Hi, I'm Michael and welcome to Ultimate Tech Hub. Today, we're going to fix this vacuum. This vacuum is an Orc. It's a nice vacuum. I've been using it for a couple years now and uh, today I was trying to vacuum the carpet. I noticed that it was making the beautiful lines, fluffing the carpet up so I know the roller was working, but nothing's getting picked up. I would see dirt and dust. It would tumble it, but it wouldn't pick it up. So if something's wrong, something's not getting sucked up into the vacuum bag, so we're going to fix that today. All right, I just finished vacuuming the floor, and I look around and I see this. The vacuum's not picking anything up. It's got all the particles on the floor. The, the carpet's fluffy, but the carpet is dirty still. So uh, let's fix it. Okay, if look on the side of the vacuum, there's the roller. It's pretty dirty, I'm probably gonna clean that up a little bit. But we're gonna take a couple screws off here and get inside here and find out what's clogging it up. And as always, make sure the cord's unplugged. So there's only two screws holding this bracket in, one on the right and one on the left. They're Phillips heads, come out rather easy. One down, two to go. And this pops right out. Ooh, there's some stuff here. It's trash in here. Oh, it looks dirty. I'm gonna clean that up too. If I wash it out real good. Let's not lose the screws. I'll put it right there. And I found the culprit. The roller is fine, but what it looks like is going on here is in here, inside this part here, is really bad. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna unclog that. It's gonna be pretty simple. I can probably use a screwdriver of some sort just to dig that out. And that should free everything up. It's a pretty simple fix, um, but it's no wonder that any of the stuff would not come out. It was just getting stopped. It would stop right here and just wouldn't go anywhere. Okay, as you can see, it is totally clogged to the top. And that goes pretty far back to where the tube is. So we're going to have to remove all that stuff, get it all out of there. And um, there's a close up of that gunk. It's uh, pretty nasty stuff. Can't imagine what's really in there, but it's it's pretty gross. It's, look at that. It's, uh, ugh. All right, here we go. Let's dig this out. Oh yeah. Look at that massive clog. Ugh. Ugh. That's probably why the vacuum is not picking anything up. Way back there. Pull this out a little bit. Get that out. So I found this back scratcher. Don't tell the wife I'm using this, but it's perfect to get down inside and get all the stuff. Pull that out. Oh yeah. Deep hit. Hey dirt. No. You wonder why this was not working. Side. And let's see. Still more in there. Okay, the next thing we're going to try is using a hanger. Maybe one of these sides here to kind of go around the corner to pull the last little piece out of junk. 
There are some in the back here I can't quite get to with a straight. Ooh, you need some more? Ooh, look at that. Nice. So I'm going to go ahead and clean the roller, get some of that hair and debris off of there. Not all of it, but just give it a good cleaning and that way it will roll better on the carpet. I'll put that bracket back on, but wait, let me wipe down the vacuum first. And look, the bracket's all clean now. I washed it in, uh, with some soap and water and it's, it's all clean, so it looks pretty. All right, I'm gonna go and make sure there's no more debris, just double check it before we get everything back together. So um, just making sure it's good to get anything excess out of there. Okay, I found a little bit more dirt in there. It's time to put on the bracket. Make sure this roller fits down in here nicely. It's going to be snug. There you go. It's going to lay flat. And that way, when you put this in, it lays flat perfectly. See? Then we'll just put the screws on. And then, and then one in here. Perfect. Now we'll assemble it back together and we'll give it a shot and we'll see how it does on dirt and grime. Okay, you can see the bag is filling up full of air, so we know the suction's coming through now. Before, it wasn't doing that. Okay, we're all done. Vacuum is clean, fixed, it works. The floor is clean now. It took about 10 minutes to get this done. Uh, it was pretty clogged, but not, uh, not so bad that I couldn't get it undone. So normally, if you took this to like a shop, they'd charge you 25, 30 bucks to fix this all. It took me 10 minutes. A back scratcher, maybe an even a, a clothes hanger, pulled all the lint out and the dirt. Now it works perfect. So thank you for watching. Hit like, subscribe it, share it, comment on it. I want to talk to you guys. Thanks again for watching.